What up, ninjas? Hey, Joe here. With an inbox review today because I will not take, I refuse, refuse highly to take this guy out of its package. Mitch or Sports Wolf or any of you guys who are like, take your toys out and play with them. This one I won't. Out of all of the Transformers and all the expensive toys that I buy, this one I will not pull out of the box. I've already had one. It broke, and I actually ended up just giving it away. But this one is the one that I still have in the box. And if you can't tell who that is, maybe, maybe, maybe you forgot. A little short-term memory loss, maybe. <laughs> oh, I love this figure. If you guys don't know who this is, this is Tommy Chong. This is Tommy Chong from the, the Cheech and Chong movie. Uh, particularly the Up in Smoke movie. Um, his character, known as Man. Just Man. Hey, Man. Hey, Man. How's it going today, man? That's his name, man. Uh, I love this figure. This is a NECA figure, however. Let me show you. NECA! And then also in the back, you can see they got some bobbly. Let me see if I can't get that. Get some bobbly heads. Those are pretty cool. Uh, my friend has Pedro. And then we got some uh, lunch boxes, and those are awesome. And then a a uh, munchie jar. I've never seen the munchie jar, but I've seen all this other stuff, so that's kind of cool. But this is a NECA figure, and Sports Wolf, as you know, NECA figures have no or literally barely any articulation. And I can tell you, this guy only has a couple points of articulation. His head does move. His glasses can come off too. Um, it doesn't move very much because of his hair. Um, his arms will move up and down because they rotate at the shoulder. He rotates at the wrist, and he rotates at the ankles. And that's it. Otherwise, he just stands there and looks ripped off his ass. And also, if you can't tell, he comes with a little doobie. Comes with a giant doobie. Well, little doobie, if you really want to get technical. But he comes with that. And, uh, yeah, I mean, he's going to stay in the package. Um, for sure. Um, I, I never really wanted to take him out because of how precious this figure was to me. My parents got this for me. It's kind of a joke, you know, like, ha ha ha, you know. But, uh, God, I really like this figure. His art, his detail is second to none. I mean, literally second to none. Um, all the detail in his denim jacket and his jeans, the rips and everything, I mean, it's perfect, spot on. I mean, there is a couple paint flaws on him that you can't really tell from the camera, but like the uh, the weathering they did with the black on his jacket to make the denim jacket look better, there's a couple spots where it'll be just a black dot where they uh, didn't properly weather. And then the same thing with the white on the bottom of the jeans. That's the that's the thing is the it, the colors mildly contrast because you have the black shading the denim jacket up here, but you have the white shading the denim jeans down there. So, I mean, it's kind of, I don't know if you can catch her that. But you can tell, I mean, all the all the white and all the wears and the rips, even the rips in the knees. I mean, everything is just spot on for this figure. And it definitely, I mean, if you can't tell, that's Tommy Chong. I mean, without having to stare at it a little bit, I don't know if you'll be able to ever tell who Tommy Chong is. Oh, this thing's falling all over the place. Sorry if I got my normal review station up, uh... So my lights are all damaged and stuff. I broke one of my lights accidentally. I fell on it and smashed it to hell, and the bulb went with it, too. So uh, so I still got my steel lamp here, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, this is just basically uh, just a action figure that you would display. He doesn't come with any stands or anything. That's why I'm just keeping him in the package so he stays nice. I mean, you can even tell on the top of the package I got some fucking... I got some dust because he's been sitting on the he's been hanging on the wall just collecting dust and he is I don't know how old he is I forgot uh, I 
doesn't really say. Uh, I know he's. I mean, I know the movie's really old, and I know the figures. Figures. I think they were made in 2000 or around there, and they did make a Cheech. They did make a Cheech Marin as well, but. I I ended up getting Tommy and I had I had both of them out of the package but I like I said I ended up giving them away to a friend who is actually uh, using them for a lot better things right now but yeah this is this is for you sports wolf I mean this is this is all you man you love NECA figures and I figured I'd do an inbox review because I don't want to take them out <laughs> so I'll get a couple close ups so you can at least see like what I'm talking about as far as the detail to the denim jacket and stuff and this is Gajo. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. Uh, check out Sports Wolf 3. He's an awesome guy. Uh, without any restraint, he is an awesome guy. He's not a douchebag. I will not resort to the douchebaggery. So, everybody, check out Sports Wolf. Keep checking out my videos. And if you like what you've seen and you want to see more, click the subscribe button and I'd be happy to keep pumping out this stuff. Thanks, guys.